Welcome to the channel, Pisces. It's your girl T, aka Vixen Tarot. Back with another reading for you guys. This is your August 2022 Tarot Card reading. I'm gonna get straight into the reading. If you're interested in booking in person with me, everything you need to know is in the description box below. It's on my Instagram. Follow me on there. It's deeply appreciated. And yeah, let's just get straight into the reading. I'm gonna use the affirmators for some oracle cards to start it off. Do them put line and then get into the reading. So, you guys, answer schemes. I can concise messages for Pisces. Sun rising, August 2022, Pisces. Sun rising, August 2022. Bottom of the deck, spirits tell me to follow your heart at all times. That will be the best GPS you have during this month. Literally, with the authentic authenticity card, is the name of the game. Whatever comes up, I will feel it. Whatever needs to be said, I will say it. Whoever doesn't get it doesn't have to get it, but at least they know it because I've said it. And that's way better than leaving a passive aggressive note. They say it's if ever you feel something, whatever you think something, speak up. Stop holding it into yourself because it comes off passive aggressive and it comes off fake. Follow your heart. That's what I'm about to say. Ah, my pen just went flying. Yeah, that's another confirmation. Follow your heart. Yeah, a lot of you guys are definitely having new options when it comes to love. Like, a lot of different people interested in you as I open to abundant possibilities in my life paths. I'm reminded I have unlimited options like this like on faith. It's because this is definitely gonna happen after you present when you're after something you can be like I'm tired of holding back how I truly feel for the sake of others, I'ma just be me. And this is you showing personal growth. You're getting this new confidence here. This new confidence. I got a new attitude. I got a new attitude. That's an old ass 80 song. But that's gonna be you. And I feel like you might be moving into your own space or moving into a different space and you're just making it your own little sanctuary, taking the time out to decorate it the way you like. Might be redecorating your room or thinking about it. take my time with y'all. It's very good to answer. the most accurate and concise messages for Pisces, August 2022. Accurate and concise messages for my Pisces, August 2022. Might be getting a new job. Spirit's telling you to work harder so you become a higher position. I think guys might have got something stolen from you. But I definitely feel like you definitely have a crush on someone here, someone new. But it's also an energy vampire with near miss. Let me get two more cards. This is my Pisces. Yeah, a lot of you guys might be internationally from a different place. Caribbean, African, Spanish. Or this is someone else that you're dealing with. Spirit wants you to manifest. Someone might be getting spell work on you. This energy vampire it might have to do with a car reverse. Make one of you lose your car, your vehicle. Or your side hustle because I also came out of race my guess being building new forms of income. And they don't like that. Alright, I'm gonna pull some career cards to get some more messages. This is you have for my Pisces, someone rising. This is you have for my Pisces, someone rising. All you guys might be nurses, LPNs, or work at a movie theater. What else? A lot of you guys might be artists, like music artists or literally some of you guys makeup artists I'm gonna get one more card some of you guys might be producers as well like in the music or date someone who's a technician I'm gonna use the crystal unicorn for the tower messages today from my Pisces God's answer is playing clear and concise messages from my Pisces, someone rising. What's the reason past energy? Could be dealing with the male, fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. What's, what's he doing here in the recent past? 
could be this energy vampire. Yep, someone that you had to heal from. A judgment call has been made here about this person because they wasn't making you feel like the Empress or the Empress of the They was making you feel bad about yourself and making you feel bored with your life. They was intentionally draining your energy, but now I see you got rid of them because they're watching you from different accounts. Could be a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius male or someone who doesn't think logically. They think with their dick. But I definitely see you calling up as the Queen of Cups here. You really have strong emotions and feelings for this person. Still do with the Two of Cups here. It's just that with the Six of Swords, you have them walk away. This person could have put you in a third party situation with the Three of Cups here. And now you're just going to new beginning to yourself. You're building a new sanctuary. You got a new attitude. Chose a path, which was you. When it comes to this person, you definitely have your guard up person might be talking shit about you to others right now anyone that could listen with the page of swords yeah they drop their guard it's like when you put your guard up they drop theirs any more energy for the present energy for my pisces someone ranging august 2022 this new person that you have a crush on might be coming in really quickly they could be a water sign or an air sign but I definitely feel like someone, I feel like this is your ex coming in because they're crying, they miss you. Yeah, but I feel like they're not holding back how they feel anymore. And they might actually try to propose to you, Pisces, or offer some high level commitment. Yeah, this person might be Aquarius, or they just view you as someone that's one of a kind, one of a lifetime. Advice from our Pisces, regarding the four lawns. Yeah, I definitely see you're in your head about it. Advice. Spirit is telling you to plant seeds and listen to your intuition. But Spirit is also saying move forward because this person put you in a really bad situation with the Father of Swords here. It could have been a Sagittarius or they was cheating on you with the Sagittarius with the Devil card and a Capricorn exposed it. But you left this person out in the cold, yeah. King and Queen of Pentacles reversed with the Ten of Cups. So definitely was a toxic relationship here. Spirit's telling you to use discernment, listen to your intuition. It wouldn't be a great idea to take this person back, but if you want a high level commitment, go for it. You trust and believe this person actually means what they say. Go for it. You got a new attitude, but I definitely see right now in the present, you focus on yourself. Like, right? yeah, definitely starting from scratch, starting from zero with the full guard. Definitely focusing on yourself. And you definitely is getting out of your head.